Fast forward 24 hours, yeah? Right in this spot. 9 a.m. this morning. I get a phone, yeah? It's ringing. Mourinho has been sacked. And for, for, for one thing out there, guys, we're not happy he's sacked. But this guy has brought this on the football club. I'm happy he's sacked. <laughs> this guy has finally gone. Finally. Because he wanted to get sacked. He was doing things to get the sack so he can collect his 18 or 20 million. This was time with you. Yeah. Time was due. Listen, the players... The players switched off a long time ago. And even though it's the fans, especially at Old Trafford, we've, we've been going. Ah, uh, too many. We, we, we've seen it. The, it's the, only the fans that have been keeping them going, bro. Yeah, yeah. He's on the time. Listen, you know the I mean? guy came. I thought his first season, give him a chance. I never wanted him. That's the truth. If you want yeah, to seriously. Truth, majority of like, United fans. Him. I wanted him. Majority of United fans who know, who, who have got history. I'm older than you. Yeah, I yeah. understand yeah. what he did at Real Madrid and what he did at Inter, right. how Inter Milan played. You know what I mean? Most people knew he's not for Man United footballing style. He was brought in to win, to get us back to winning the league quickly, right? So that we yeah. didn't go 10 years without winning the league. Unfortunately, that's not happened. He won the Europa League, trophy we didn't win, he the Cup. I'm happy about that. I will thank him for that. That, that, that worthless cup, I'm not asked about Europa that. Europa League? Um, no, the worthless cup. The, okay, the yeah, yeah, the, the league cup. cup, yeah, yeah. No, I asked about that. No, I asked. Did you give me the goal from me? Yeah? Someone tell me. Yeah, listen. I, I, I said a couple of weeks ago to Flex on the United stand. I was like, we should we should start go fund me. We should do a go fund me and get rid of this guy and give him that twenty million. Why is it taking so long? Why is it taking United Club so long to do it? Because I don't. I think maybe because of his his history that him winning things, they're thinking that he can be able to turn it around. But once you lose the players, man, that's it. But one thing I want to say, right now. The three things United and Man United need to do. Three things, right? Okay. So let's split them into three different sections. In terms of the ball and structure, United need a footballing Sport director. Hundred percent. We need someone that knows football. Footballing director. We need a transfer committee. Okay. And we need to get the top scouts in Europe. We need to go and employ really one or two or three or even four top scouts in Europe. Yeah. Right. That's what we need to do. That's that's in terms of the above. Yeah. Right. So that Woodward and the rest of them can concentrate well, on the marketing. He's got to go as well, man. No, listen, they, no, listen. They, they've got to concentrate on the marketing, right? Yeah. That's what we need, the structure above, right? Yeah. Man United need to get... I think if they, if they put an interim manager in till the end of the season, or yeah. managers, the end of the season, then they're going to go for Pochettino. I think Pochettino... Perfect fit for me. Yeah, he, he's, he's made for Man United in the sense that he improves young players, and this is a step up. This is like his... He'll be peaked then because he's been at Southampton, he's been at Tottenham. Some people say it. And now, and, and I believe he will win things. And Man United, because we'll be patient, we'll get behind him. When you have all that goodwill behind you, because you can play young players. The three, thing, the, the three things you have to do, Old Trafford, yeah, yeah. improve players, yeah. play young players, and play attractive football. Yeah. You will have United fans worldwide eating at the palm of your hands. Exactly. That is, that will happen. Football. That will happen, right? So, that will happen. At the moment, people are talking about Oliver, so Oliver, I, I don't mind that because yeah. he's a legend. Listen, he's a legend, right? Okay, okay, okay. But as a part of the coaching, I'd rather get Mullerstein in yeah. than get... Mike Feeling. Mike Feeling. I'm sorry, Mike Feeling, is, he's had his day, man. He's had his day. That's why he's in the Sky Studios and stuff like that. He's, he, he's had, the guy, he Oliver was good on the Fergie, but I'm telling you, just the end of the season, till the end yeah, of the yeah, season, yeah. right? But I think Mullerstein is a, ta he's a tactician guy. He knows about football. He knows one-touch football. Yeah. I mean, United will be able to play one-touch football. So... Maybe Mulusin comes in. If not, give it Laurent Blanc, give it Jardine, yeah. and if they do good, then they can they can take the job. But I'm just happy the toxic guy that is Jose Mourinho is out of the club. That doesn't mean Man United are going to go to Cardiff and smash them five nil. No, 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 the troubles are still there. We know football. We need to reset Listen, as a football club. We know football. We're not Muppets. We know about football. It's going to take time. Whoever the next manager comes is going to take time. The interim guys is going to take time. Because they have to do it. To me, my only thing is that they have to do it in a training ground. Yeah. We need a man manager man and a manager. coach. I know. Guy who can put his arm around yeah, yeah, yeah. players, right? Knows what players to shout at. Knows what players to, to, to have a go at. Knows what players to put his arm around, show and look. He needs to identity. And we need a guy who club. smiles a little bit. Just bring a bit of energy yeah, or yeah. beatness to the place. That's one thing I wanted to I want a manager who's going to play training ground football and, and implement on the football pitch, you know what I'm saying? I want a person who's going to have a philosophy, an idea, you know what I mean? Like Pochettino, like you're saying, this guy has worked on a budget at Tottenham Football Club, yeah? And he's out, he's out, out, out scoring us every season. He's out, you know what I mean? Go up on the table every season. And it's, I think, it's, for me, it's a prime choice for us. But going back to Oliver Solskjaer, yeah? What can he give United? Because for me, I don't know if it's proven. 
Yeah, it's not about proving. I'm t- it's only interim. Yeah. It's interim. It's only till the end of the season. Yeah. Right. So it's only till till May. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's what yeah, that yeah, point yeah. will be. But I think you could get somebody better. A point. You could get Blanc or Jardine, and then see how yeah. they do. And, and then maybe you won't be able to get um, Pochettino yet because Pochettino signed five year contract. No, you don't. Last season. But and it's gonna million, cost. Man. It's gonna. But it's gonna cost more than that apparently. Because is it? Because for him, for mm-hmm. Daniel Levy to release him, and he's all his backroom manager, uh, backroom coaching staff, it's gonna to be a lot Especially of money. Especially with the Levy stadium. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well. It it's gonna be a lot of money. Stadium? So, but to me, Zinedine Zidane is another option with Evera. Yeah. But all these things can happen. But I'm just glad. I'm glad we can go to the game now. I know, man. Right. I, I know can't wait stadium. for this field now. Just go to I just want to see expansive football. Just but see what I want to go on is the board, man. I think they're getting away with this. Of course they Ed are. Woodward and the, Listen, the we won them out. Where's we the glazer? Where's, where's, where's the scarf, yo? Bring the scarf out, man. Ever present scarf, man. For this me, is, uh, I've forgotten about it. Today. That's, the, that's how happy they failed. <laughs> they failed over the last four or five years. That's yo. how happy I am. I forgot about the scarf. The guys depressed me, but yes, you're right, 100%. Sorry to interrupt. You know what I mean? The Glazers, man, they've yeah, got yeah. it wrong for me. They have. They've absolutely. They have. The how they employed club. Moyes, I still. You know I, mean? free I still have them. nightmares about that. I still have nightmares the about game, that. Before the game, when I was there, man, 43 crosses, man. It was a wrong appointment. They got Sir Ferguson involved. They shouldn't have done that. That's why the committee comes in and the footballing director, the person who will know the football club inside out, and then we move on as a football club, you know what I mean? Yeah, 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 of course. We can't always look back. This is true to that. We can't. But then I look at like somebody like Bayern Munich and they're successful because... But then, but Yeah. Hummelage the guy. Yeah, like, you they know football what I mean? footballing brains at the top. Yeah, and this is the thing. So we need guys there. And they all play for Bayern Munich. But then, to be fair, Bayern Munich, that's a lot of pub league, mate. That's, a yeah. pub. that's not a pub league, but I like German football. It's not a pub league. But they just grow up all the best players in Germany. So where, where do you want to go? What's the ambition for United now? What What's is the ambition? ambition for now? me... Just to play better football now. Get in the training ground. Let's see some <laughs> style of play. That's and the first thing I want to see. Yeah. Lose, win, whatever. You I just want to see style of play. Because yeah. I'm sick to tired of... Philosophy. Oh. An idea. So, I don't want Conte. I don't want Simeone. I don't want any of the defensive managing. I I've don't want any that. of that. I've I don't want sick of that. I want to lose games. 6-5. I want to win. 4-5. <laughs> you don't know win, guys. I want to, you know what I mean? 3-4. <laughs> You know what I mean? 4 3. I want to win these things. Yeah. I want those goals. I want goals back at Old Trafford. I don't want a depressing, ugh, limping over the line kind of thing. Yes, no, you can't play all of that all the time. Yeah. There are some games in the season where you have to pick up the 1 0. Yeah. Liverpool should like to win a league. That's what happens. Yeah. But I want expansive football. That's what I want. That's what we deserve. Yeah. We deserve that. And in the long term, you know what I mean? Where's the structure, the transfer? The structure for who, me. Who do we need now? What the, what's the manager got to put in place now? Because he's got two centre backs here. Are they, for me, yeah, yeah. I don't know if they're good enough for me. Lindelof and Bain. I'll be real with you. I think with the right coach. With the right coach, okay. I think they would be. Okay. I think they've both got the abilities. The Especially Lindelof can play the ball out. He's a good footballing player. Okay. I think, Maybe under the manager you mean. I think there, Luke Shaw. Luke Shaw and give him a chance. Luke Shaw. The lot. And the, the midfield for me, if you pick up Pogba Fred. And Herrera. Be a new, right. Alex, Sanche- Alexis Sanchez. Alexis Sanchez. Alexis Sanchez. Right. Right. Oh, Lukaku. Let him lose the muscle, whatever he has to do. Let yeah. him lose a bit of weight, whatever, yeah. whatever he has to do. He can do that. What we need is a structure. It, we need an absolute structure yeah. of direct... I said it, I went through it earlier in the video. Yeah. And that's what we need. We need those guys. But I think we've got enough players. We need to get rid of eight players. Yeah, go on, name them. The lamppost on the tree. So, first on the list. Right, and that's in the summer. We can't get rid of them now in January, but that's in the summer. Yeah. We need to get rid of Smalling and Jones. What, Smalling side of contract? <laughs> I don't care, mate. We need, they need pay to pay you out. Pay you out. Um, no, actually, Smalling can stay. Yeah, yeah, back Smalling up. can back, back up. Yeah, yeah, third yeah. choice, third choice. So you know how to send her off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He can stay there. Jones gone. Uh, yeah, Valencia's yeah. gone. Ashley Young's gone. God, yeah, yeah. We also need to get rid of. <sighs> when I look at maybe Rojo. Do you know what? To be fair, I don't know, man. I, I, like, I keep him over Smalling. I can't I, like so I just want to see. Ah, Passion, I see that. You gotta get some of the midfielders in. That's what I want to see. You keep Herrera. Yes, of course I'll okay. keep Herrera. Yeah, keep, I yeah. would keep Herrera. I would keep Mata. Definitely. Yeah, yeah, definitely Mata. Quite now Mata. I hope that Mata plays in the hole. I really hope oh, Mata can play in the days, hole. Man. Be I really hope Mata can play in the hole behind the striker now. Rashford Mata. Get Lukaku. Get, get on that gym, lad. Get on yeah, that. Yeah. Get off the weights, lad. For me, get on that bike. Get on that treadmill. It's gonna get be... on that rowing machine. Lose those <laughs> muscle, mate. Lose it's that muscle. It's going to be a decision between Alex Sanchez and Martial. The manager has to pick a decision. Yeah, yeah, oh, Martial. You can't have both of them. 
And then people are having to go up Paul Pogba, man. They need ah, to that's get off his you back. see the uh, Instagram post, yo? Yeah, listen, they have to get listen, off his that's, back. Listen, that's commercial, man. You know listen, what I'm listen. It's an easy target, though. Isn't listen, it? you know what? He needs to get off his back, man. Right. I'm telling to you. To me, man. I can't defend him. He can't defend him. No, 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 no. We who, who understand Pogba cannot defend him if he's crap under a new attacking manager. Then we will be on your side yeah, saying, yeah. get rid of him. Yeah, yeah. But no, Mourinho's toxic, mate. Look what he done at Real Madrid. Look what he did at Chelsea. He's toxic. You have to understand that the manager is toxic. Yeah, yeah. He's the guy who makes decisions on the training ground, on a, on, on a Saturday, on a Wednesday, on a Tuesday. Who, what team to pick? He's toxic. The style of football is toxic. I'm glad. Early Christmas present. Early Christmas Merry present. Christmas to all those who I don't say that, mate. Merry Christmas to all of us. We have to, it's a bit of a relief. Seriously, my last six months of the oh, season. Let's just go out there. I can't play anymore. I've got fat four knee surgeries. I can't play anymore. So I've got, I've got, I'm watching watch United. The fo- watch the I go football. to the game to go and get off my chest, shout at the boys, say, come on United. That's what I do. That's what I do. I'm an old man now. So, fingers crossed. Yeah. Come on United. Old times. We'll never die. And but, like we said, we don't, we don't want the managers. We didn't want Mourinho to get sacked, but he brought him put on himself. He did, man. man. He, he wanted did. to get sacked, man, from last season. He wanted to get sacked. The things he could, what he did, he should have been sacked after the Seville game. Yeah, 100%. For coming out with, are you kidding me? What he came out with? What he was saying? Oh, I've sat here and beat Man United. And so how you telling us about how good Sevilla? Shut up. Listen, that that should have been... That, it's the only game... Actually, there's two, two games in my life. I've been going since I was nine years old. Sneaking in most of the times, right? Through the years, my teenage years. The two games I've ever left early was the Seville game. Five minutes, I'm like, you know what? I'm going, I'm going. I couldn't take it. No, no. I couldn't take it. I seen... I just had the red mist, right? Literally. Yeah. I had to walk. And then the, the Crystal Palace game... I left four minutes. That's why my thing went viral, the rant went viral, because I was just so responded. I was just, I was like, I can't pre- I'm looking around the stadium thinking, why are you, why are we taking this? Yeah, yeah. Why are you becoming so apathetic? The guy lowered our standards, yeah, yeah. lowered our, and telling me about how good Liverpool's left back is. Robertson, that, that for me. You did that on purpose. Curtain. You did it on purpose, telling Jesse to stay inside. Exactly. So that he gets all of the room. Nobody was tracking back with him. You took the lot off so they can have that as a talk. That's a talking point. Come on, man. You're a master manipulator. Goodbye. You're, you're not a working class guy. You're later. not. You're a guy who's a multi-millionaire now, right? Yeah. And you're getting and you're smiling. Look, he's left. Smiling, he's smiling. Smiling. Spot, See you later, mate. You lived in a hotel. Later. I called it a year and a half ago. I said it. The guy lives in a hotel. He don't give a damn. He wanted to pay out. And that's you probably see you trying to find him. That's <laughs> come true, mate. I've been looking for him. Try <laughs> give him the money, mate. I wanted to give him the money personally when we collected it. But anyway, guys, you heard it first. Mourinho's gone. Final curtain for Mourinho. Peace. Um, Peace. Hopefully, Peace. see you attack football. Peace. Anyway, guys, you know what to do. Subscribe to United Central. Like the video. And I'm out, guys. See you, Cardiff.